HTTV in association with Absolute Warehouse Services. Lewis, what went wrong today? Um, I just think we let ourselves down. Um, we didn't do the things that we've been doing for the last seven, eight games. Uh, we didn't work hard enough. We didn't. We didn't fight. We um, we let ourselves down massively. And we let the fans down as well. When you go a goal down as early as that, how hard is that mentally to try and change the focus, especially when you haven't started overly well? Yeah, it's hard. But I mean, it was that early on that <clears throat> we can't really affect anything because we had, we didn't really get going. So we just needed to to clean our minds and and go again. But obviously, it's very hard to do that. And we knew from the offset that one of their main strengths and threats would be from set pieces. How hard were they to deal with? Yeah, definitely. They were they were tough because they had a lot of big lads. Um, they went quite direct and won, won a lot of second balls. Um, I just don't think we were aggressive enough all over the pitch, really. When you're in a game and you're not being aggressive enough, how, how do you change that? You just got to try and work harder than them. Um, but Unfortunately, we none of us did that today. Um, we got outworked, outfought, and um, that's the basics that we need to do to win games. And we didn't do them today, so we're very disappointed. And then we came out in the second half. Obviously, then you're looking at kind of getting back into the game, and then to concede so early on in that half kills the game off, doesn't it? Yeah, I think the momentum was with, was with them from the from the start of both halves. So, um, they kept us in in our own half a lot. Um, and we had to we had to roll the dice, and they got a goal early on in the second half. But it's the same as the first. We need to just try and reset it and and go again. But it it was uh, one after another, and the the hard things to take. Saying that final 15 minutes, there are a lot of positives that we can take from that. Janino Bakuna scoring his fourth goal of the season and created a lot of chances too. Yeah, definitely. I mean, it, there's a lot of positives, but it's it also reflects a disappointing side to it because. Um, it was our fault. We we could have played like that the whole game. It, it shows that we should have played like that the whole game. And there's reasons why I don't know what the reasons why we didn't. But it's frustrating to to play like that last last 15 because then you know that you could have played like that the whole game. And there were over 3,000 fans here. They stuck with us, but we'll need them in the hard times and the easier times, won't we? Yeah, definitely. I think in my last interview I said we we were riding the wave and. Um, there was going to be hard times and they've just got to stick with us like they've been doing through the good. There's also going to be bad, um, but we move on from it. Like you said, there's still a lot of work to do here. There's a, it's a big project for the Cowleys. Now we're going into the international break. It's a good time for us to kind of continue that work that we've been doing. Yeah, definitely. It's time to reflect on um, what we've done the last eight games. Um, there's been a lot of positives, but in the games even that we win and that we draw, there's still negatives. So... This um, this time that we have now, we're um, we're gonna work even harder to correct the mistakes. Thank you for speaking to us. Cheers.